If you happen to catch my video on Battery Center, in it I alluded to an upgraded version of Battery Center called Power Center. And here it is, folks. It's called Power Center Pro. Uh, it's a notification center jailbreak widget for iOS 5. And there it is. There are some toggles right here, but you'll also notice something familiar. There's the battery. And then you have this information here that tells you all about your iPhone, your network, your Wi Fi address, you know, your data, IP, free RAM, etc. Let's zoom in a little bit so we can see that a little bit better. Here it is. So here is Power Center Pro. You have all these different stats, your capacity, how much free space you have, your SSID for your network. And then you have, of course, the battery center, which gives you some stats on your battery, whether or not it's plugged, unplugged, and how much juice you have left. Uh, so that's that. And then you have these toggles here, which is very SB settings-esque. As you'll, you can see, you have lock, respring, and they have confirmation uh, little notifications that come up once you tap those. So that's pretty handy just so you don't accidentally um, respring or turn off you know, Bluetooth or whatever. And you have this volume and brightness. Now the volume and brightness actually appear below. Let me just show you here below. Here's the brightness slider. You can just let me grab that. Oh, let me grab that. There's the brightness slider so you can adjust the brightness. Um, and what's really nice about this is that all of these are themable. You can theme these toggles uh, to make it look however you like them once more themes are released of course now there is a settings app and literally it's a standalone app as you'll see here the app loads power center pro and here are all the settings for power center pro now watch if i go to my home screen you see the actual app icon for power center pro so you can access it via that way as well and then you have uh where you can actually toggle notification center on or off directly from this app itself so you don't have to go into your notification in your settings app which is kind of handy yeah, that confirmation dialog that I showed you earlier when you try to turn on Wi-Fi, etc. Um, and then you have last active page and respring on exit. Now, one of the best features about Power Center Pro is the fact that it's themable. Yes, you can actually download additional themes from Cydia. If you go here to themes at the top, and then you'll see help with themes, you'll see featured themes and installed themes. You can notice I have two installed themes. I have the default, which of course comes with Power Center Pro, and the minimal theme, which I actually downloaded from Cydia a bit earlier. Now, if you under featured themes, if you tap that, it'll actually take you eventually to a Cydia page, which has the themes information. I'm gonna just tap that right there. And there you can see it's opening up Cydia and it'll take you directly to the Cydia page for that specific theme. And it has some stats on the theme, it has some photo, a uh, picture of the theme, so you can kind of know exactly what to expect once you install the theme and you enable it in Power Center Pro. So that is nice, and you can probably expect a lot more themes to be made in the future, but there's just one out there now. It's called Minimal. So I'm going to go ahead and enable that theme, as you can see there. And then if you just select Respring on Exit, you can see I have the normal theme there. But if you select Respring on Exit, it'll respring your phone. And once it comes back up, you'll notice that the theme is now in minimal mode instead of default. So there's the theme in minimal mode. Let's zoom in on that bit. Minimal looks pretty nice, doesn't it? But again, you could expect a lot more themes hopefully to be made in the future and available for free download. So once you purchase a Power Center Pro, then you should have eventually a lot more themes to choose from for all your toggles. Again, it's called Power Center Pro. It's sort of like an SB settings, you know, it has the toggles and all that, but it also has the battery and things like that. So I don't know, it's kind of high. I have to admit it, 249, it is a little high, um, but as you saw, it's very flexible, it has the theming capabilities and things like that. Uh, and it is available in Notification Center and it does have its own standalone app. So I would expect a lot more features to be added to this in the future. Hopefully we'll see some more themes. Let me know what you think about Power Center Pro in the comment section below, folks. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.